What's good, y'all boys? We back with another video, man. And, hey, we gonna be checking out 10 most disgusting and nasty foods people actually eat. Now, if y'all stomach gets sick, man, I'm sorry. Like, that's all I can say on. I'm sorry, all right? Or if you think your stomach gonna get sick, then move on to another video or something like that. Like, that's literally all I can say. But um, we gonna go ahead and get right into it. So, um, yeah, three, two, one. Guys, are you a foodie too? Oh. Who loves to try different foods from simplest to weirdest kinds? Yes, you that? heard the right word, weird. You may feel cringe, but people around the world are simply licking their chops. So, we hope that you've brought your appetite to know because oh, we are going to count know. the 10 weirdest and disgusting foods in the world. But before this, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for such amazing facts. Here we go. Number 10. Tuna eyeballs. Its main region is Japan. Many oh, people try yeah. tuna eyeballs for the first time and I swear they're hooked on them. It's a fairly cheap dish. It can be served as simply by boiling or steaming and seasoning with soy sauce or garlic. Tuna eyeballs taste a bit like squid. The muscles and fats that surround the eyeballs are the oh, yummiest part for its enjoyer. No way y'all gonna catch me eating that, bro. Nasty, however, people somewhere love to eat it. Moving on to number nine. Way y'all gonna catch me eating that, bro. It comes the 100-year egg, also called century egg in different places. It's a Chinese preserved food. The eggs of chicken, quail, and duck uh. have been preserved for a long time by the coating of alkaline clay. Century uh. eggs can also be... And people actually eat that? Yo, that's nasty, bro. Yo, that is nasty, bro. And people actually eat that, bro. Yo, that's nasty. Be eaten with outside preparations, other than peeling and rinsing them. At special events, it is served with sliced pork and head cheese as a cold dish. Oh, hell no, bro. Number eight. Balut. Balut serves as street food in the Philippines. It is a fertilized bird egg, commonly duck. The inner matter inside the egg, which is a well-developed embryo, is soft enough to be eaten as a whole. It is considered a cheap source of calcium right, and protein. About to make me sick, I can bro. never even touch it for various bro, reasons. About to make me sick, bro, y'all oh, 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 about to make me sick, bro. Bro, y'all about to make me sick, bro. What? Number seven. Bird's nest soup. The nests of birds are made up of edible swiftlets. Nests, Indian swiftlers, and other swiftlets using solid saliva. Its region is Southeast Asia and East Asia. It is not wrong to say that you are eating a bowl of spit. Yes, exactly. It is made up of bird saliva, which is dry and hardened. Hmm. Now it hey, might seem eat disgusting, that, but it is believed that it has like, some bro, magical nasty. properties, like curing cancer, building a strong immune system, helping children. Bro. These foods that I just saw, bro, if anybody serves me that, bro, I'm not eating it, bro. I'm not eating it. ...to grow taller. These nests are so expensive. For example, in New York, it's like thousands of dollars. Whoa. Number six. Wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. Thousand, thousands of dollars? So y'all telling me y'all wasted... Y'all wasted... All of y'all money just to buy that nasty stuff. What? Y'all wasting all y'all money just to buy that nasty stuff? Like what? Hot pot. Hot pot is a Chinese fondue, most popular food serving in China. It is prepared by poaching the pot of soup stock. Normally, the hot pot ingredients are vegetable, leaves, mushrooms, and seafood. Raw material sliced into thin sections that will cook consistently in the simmering broth. The reason for the popularity of hot pot is that it is considered a great way of socializing. People can sit together and do the chit chat. Number five. Bag of cheese. Oh, hell no. You all are thinking now that this item would be delicious because it's cheese. But no, listen. This cheese is penetrated with insect larvae called oh, maggot cheese. Know, the bro. cheese made up from sheep's milk is pecorino, 
which has larva introduced in it. Then fermentation occurs side by side. The cheese becomes soft as the larva digests the cheese fats. It has now been banned for health reasons, but still selling in black in Sardinia and somewhere in Italy. Oh, so which nasty, one is the bro. most weird for you until now? Hey, y'all Share it in the comment bro, section like... and don't move on. Here is something more for you. Number four. Yak penis. Yak penis. Yes, you heard right. This is mostly found in Taiwan, Beijing, and other cities of China. The yak penis is similar to the actual meat. Firstly, it has to be opened and washed thoroughly. Later, stews the meat. So we out here eating. So we out here eating. How can I say it? I don't want to say it too inappropriate. So, so we out here eating. Um, damn, I don't even know what to say, but um, yeah. Eat in a pot and served with soy sauce, spices, and herbs to add taste and make it yummy. It is said that as soon as the penis hits your tongue, it activates the brain and enhances sexual desire. My God. Number three. White ant's egg soup. This is a Laotian dish and made up of white ant eggs. It is common to see in Thailand, Vietnam, and Cambodia. It contains a mixture of eggs, partial embryo, and maybe ants. It is said that people who have tasted it said the eggs released a sour flavor after popped in the mouth. You may all produce sounds like, I'm oh, no, disgusting. Ants, but this delicacy is supposed to be quite tasty. Number two. San Nakji. San Nakji is related to Korean cuisine. It is prepared with a sharp knife. When the dish is ready to serve, the octopus tentacles jiggle amongst carrots, cucumbers, etc. Many Koreans eat by wrapping it around the chopsticks and popping it into their mouth. The taste is chewy, salty, which attracts culinary air Look at him, he like, number oh, I don't know, bro. that number, that's shit nasty. Khash. Khash is the king of the Armenian winter table. It is the boiled parts of cows or sheep. The parts include the head, stomach, or feet. The process of making khash is long yet oh, interesting. The feet and other parts are cleaned and kept in cold oh, water no. to rid of oh, the bad smell. Later, the boiling process begins bro. until the water becomes thick. Raw. No other ingredient is added at the time of boiling. Rather, you should present the spices at the time of serving. Khash is a traditional dish in some Caucasian countries too. Now, are you ready to do experiments with such foods and challenge your friends too? If yes, then good luck. And let us know in the comment section. We would love to hear from you guys. Before moving to the next. Alright y'all, that's enough for the video. Y'all go ahead, like and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? And later.